नमस्कार वेलकम टू लूनर एस्ट्रो सो टूडेज टॉपिक वॉट वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस इज म्यूजिक एंड रेमिडीज हाउ म्यूजिक कैन हेल्प यू प्रोग्रेस इन लाइफ हाउ म्यूजिक कैन हेल्प यू रिमूव अप सैकल्स इन लाइफ एंड दिस इज समथिंग यू नो विच आई हैव ट्राइड एंड टेस्टेड सेवरल टाइम्स बिकॉज वेन आई वॉज राइटिंग माई माई बुक रिचुअल्स ऑफ हैप्पी सोल द ओरिजिनल नेम एंड स्टिल द ओरिजिनल ऑफ दैट प्रोजेक्ट फाइल विच आई सेंड आउट फॉर द पब्लिशिंग वॉज माई एक्सपेरिमेंट विद रागस that was the original thought that i will write the complete book on ragas but later on i thought you know let us combine everything in one book give the glimpse of it and then i will explain the ragas in separate chapters or separate book so this is a detailed version what you have, what is written in book this will help you out because i saw a lot of queries on facebook regarding the ragas and once you try these this particular remedy the beauty of this particular remedy is there is no ritual about it i mean you see the hindustani classical music it is so scientifically designed because what music is why music was designed people say you know music does not have a language and this is very true music does not have language at least not the language of this universe because all the language languages which we are speaking is designed by us like i can speak hindi english punjabi bangla indonesian arabic these are designed by the cultural norms wherever we are living but music is something which is same across the universe so a hit song might be in russian and you can still enjoy it a hit song can be in arabic and you can still enjoy it so what music does is when you listen to music you are able to travel to a different realm this is what happens to you like if you are driving a car or if you're traveling in a bus if you're traveling in train what happens when you put your music and your phones in you actually go in that dreamy zone while listening to music and there are certain songs which will remind you of certain people this is the power of music this is the power of uh, the words within the music even in the when i was teaching the badaka course and if you see the remedies in it one of the remedies was singing in front of dt this is the remedies mentioned in the classical text that you have to sing a song in front of god and this is a remedy for you to get rid of this particular problem so what is that particular remedy why the singing has been advised and why i am telling you that you should listen to particular music because what happens is once you listen to a particular word for example let me give you a very practical example one of my friends was suffering from a problem related to kids and he has a very typical habit from very old time to use a particular word which actually means the one which is without father and he'd say that in a punjabi language and he used that word very frequently in every sentence now what happens is what what happened in this particular case was it was like 2 years back i told him you know you keep repeating this particular word so many times that whoever is not coming whoever is uh, you are dealing with you will use this word throughout the day to long living things and non living things eventually what has happened is this word contains energy and this energy has affected a particular planet in your chart that is why you are getting problems in becoming a father why don't you replace this word and use some started using something else it took him about 4 to 5 months to get used to the new word which i gave him it's like a switch word and switch words absolutely work this is what i'm why i'm telling you you know you should never repose things until and unless you completely understand them the moment the person replaces that word it's like a switch word remedy eventually he was able to become a father after a certain amount of time a very simple remedy only by replacing a word in life so you should very carefully look what are the words you commonly use in day to day life this is the reason why i always say whenever you call your kids you always use names like sundar bahadur uh, rajay whatever are the appreciating names like sundar is the name of hanuman ji and this was given to him so that he should not have any kind of inferiority complex and within him due to his looks so if your kid is doing something bad if your kid is not listening to you focus on where is the problem lying on 
I mean, I can see last two days there are continuous posts on what to do when the kids will not listen to you, and I will cover that within this this particular lecture. You try this, and you can give me feedback. Trust me, I've tried this with my kids, and you will bless me uh, regarding this. That if your kids are not listening to you, or anyone who's not listening to you, whatever the problem you're facing, I will give out for everyone. So, what happens when you listen to music? You travel to different dream. Before sleeping, listening to music is extremely important. The reason being is you're preparing your soul to travel and connect to a different energy source. So, let's suppose you you sleep without shower. You're sleeping on a dirty bed. You're sleeping on a place which is too, totally congested. The oxygen levels are low. You are going to connect to that kind of feeling because you attract energy. Bad energy is like bad smell. You're not taking shower at night. So sleeping is such an important ritual in your life that to sleep, you should be very careful that at 9 p.m. at any point of time, I'm going to leave everything. Start preparing for the sleep, start taking shower, get your bed organized, get the room organized clean. And that is why you see why our parents used to say, you know, never keep the dirty dishes in the sink in the night. Sink has to be clean in the night. Reason being is what you're doing in the night, you're attracting that negative energy in the morning when you wake up. The first thing you will see is that those dirty utensils in the sink. So you make sure that before you sleep, clean your house. It's a very effective remedy to make, you know, to declutter your life. So once you go to sleep and you connect to different world, different realm, and which realm you will be connected to, wherever your brain is. So if you are sleeping after watching a violent movie or a very hallucinating movie, not cleaning in, in a very clean position, not sleeping in a very clean position, all this is going to affect your healing process because when you sleep you actually heal yourself you see all our gods they have a process to heal us and to get into healing mode the brain has to sleep and get connected to a particular realm so when you are listening to rag yaman you will sleep very peacefully and i've tried this with in my practical cases i've tried this with my clients i'm telling you this actually works so there was a person who had a K2 second house. His son has a K2 second house. And I said, do one thing. When you sleep, try sleeping with his hand holding or keep one of his things with you and see what is a relation with you in the past life. So he, he, they both you know, sleep together in the same bed. He kept on trying to hold the hand. Very young kid, like two or three years old. In this sleep, he saw an army officer, two army officers, a father and a son, and both were crying that they are going to get separated away. Get to second house. You see the family separation. This is what he had a dream. This is now he knows, you know, that, that Ketu being in a Martian sign. Now you know that the, the feeling of separation was there in the family. The kid has come back. There has to be an army background within the family. This is how you actually go through in the deeper layers of the life. This is how you understand your chart in a way which no astrologer can explain. I'm telling you, no astrologer can explain until unless you experience it. So when you, so when you're going to perform these remedies, which are very karmic remedies, your experiences are going to be unique depending on your energy, because your chart is different. It is about. For me, the argument is most peaceful. For you, it might create you a lot of troubles. You have to go through that emotional turmoil because you are getting connected to the realm of moon and moon might be in a troubled position. You might see things related to your mother, related to the emotional part, which you will be like, why it has happened in past life? Why I'm not able to do this? So <clears throat> these words, which the, the, the rhythm of music is extremely important. You see all our gods, na, they they carry a particular music instrument like Master Sosati carries a Veena. Bhagavan Shiv carries a Dambu. Shri Krishna does the flute. And all these instruments are the symbol that this is the way the deity is going to get connected to you. This is the way the, they are going to heal the world. So when you pray in a particular rag, 
for example let me give you a very simple very simple example if you listen to a particular rag in a and you know the particular prayer in a, diff, in a particular rag that is going to affect you give you most fast results like what what happens when you do kirtan kirtan has a certain rhythm certain certain way to get connected to the outer realm. you go into an entirely different zone so let's suppose you have a fourth house jupiter in a scorpion sign and you start listening to the rag of mars and you do the prayer of jupiter like you pray to lord jupiter but because where is jupiter situated jupiter is situated in the realm of mars and ketu ketu is devotion mars you know the rag bhairavi so when you pray when you when you read purushottam in rag bhairavi that day within it within three or four days you'll see an extraordinary results this is a very simple way to get connected to the planet but as i said you know when you perform a remedy so you are getting connected to the scorpion sign and that to jupiter that scorpion jupiter that bharav effect of brahman is going to come to you to take away whatever karma you had with that to the jupiter but i'm telling you once it happens now once that that energy pass through you will have a lot of relief you will be like okay it's it's over now i don't have to deal with this anymore so i'll i'm going to give out the all the for all the problems i'm going to list out the problems and then you can choose your ragas which problem you are facing and at the same time you can also make your own remedies problem related to vision in life what i have to do where i have to go if we lot of anxiety issues if you have a depression issue that means the sun is not in a very good position sun is not performing well or some other planet has taken over the sun this is the only reason because you know the plant sun when it is working in your chart it shows in your body it, you have a vision that after three years this is going to happen after five years this is going to happen this is how i'm going to take care of these things you don't panic in any situation this is how the government works you don't panic and they have a validity of whatever they speak so if this is related to sun if you have a sun related issue the rag darbari rag shadabina and uh, this is rag shud these are the three yag or oh, sorry rag tanpura rag shadabina and rag darbari these three ragas when you will listen this is for the sign of leo so let's suppose mars is sitting in sign of leo so you start doing hanuman chalisa and rag shadabina or rag darbari this will help you out and you will find that all these ragas are on youtube also there is a very wonderful uh, app somebody told me there is another one ragas there is the name of the app the another one is the hml scl i think uh, that's the name of the of the music app yeah scl is the name of the music app <clears throat> so all three are the wonderful way to get into these these particular music apps once you will start listening to it what is going to happen your brain will start changing the patterns because when you speak a word like if i speak lunar astro right so a image will come to your picture a image will a logo will come into your picture it will make a particular yantra over here this is what you start attracting because when i was experimenting with ragas and i still do the moment i will stay play rag darbari in my car what happens is people take sudden turns in front of my car so i stop playing it i have a son with rahu it is bound to expect and they had to do like that and especially i will have problems whenever i will cross there's a place where there's an alcohol shop around that place only i have noticed something changes the energy changes the people start crossing in a very random manner but the moment i will play rag yaman at the ride will be extremely smooth but i will have a certain kind of anxiety while listening to rag yaman and driving then because of a moon ketu example all these things you have to notice what happens when you listen to a particular rag who comes to house what what is the behavior of pets in the house because this is what you're doing you're making a yantra in your body and the in, within the house this is creating a certain pattern within the within the within the house 
which is going to create and absorb the energy. Now this energy will change the complete atmosphere. So problems related to kids, problem related to stomach, health related issues, depression, vision problem. These are the three targets you need to listen. Then comes the moon. Moon is healing. Moon is how much of emotional balance we are, how much secure you feel, how much like when you sleep, can you sleep in an extremely straight position without worrying about anything? Can you, are you that stress free in life? Because people, you know, who do not have any kind of stress, they can just lie down and sleep in one go. This is how calm the moon is. So Rag Yaman, Rag Komal, Rag Shud and Hansadwani. These are the four ragas. Problems related to moon, healing, when you don't feel comfortable with other people. This is, these are the ragas which will help you out in managing the emotions. You will be very clear with what I require. This is what my requirement is. I mean, look, this, this is how moon is. Extremely unstable. Changes the emotions very quickly. But once it starts getting stable, start focusing on one problem. This is when you will say, this is what my soul requirement is. This is what I will eat today. The third raga, which when you face property related issues, you have anger related issues. You do not know how to challenge your creativity. When you do not know how to get and form friendships, how to deal with friends. We have violence related issues within the family. Then you have raga bhairavi, raga savi, raga tori. These are the three ragas. Like other day I gave out one of the remedies that somebody was facing the problems related to politics in office. The people were not respecting, they were aggressive. I said, listen to Rag Bhairavi and go to office. Very simple. And you should see the changes. Because Rag Bhairavi has a certain effect which it will do and you will start radiating that energy within few, within some time period. What I've noticed is when you, the moment you listen to Rag Bhairavi, your sweating increase. Like there is some kind of a a metabolism increase when while listening to Rag Bhairavi and on continuous basis like there is a particular uh, Rag on Rag that, that's a particular you know uh, prayers to Ma Kali which is a Kali Sahastra Nama it's a wonderful Rag it is sung in Rag Bhairavi by one of the people and once you listen to it you will realize the first of all your body metabolism changes, your thought process change and you will like, okay, I can get it done this way. And the effect of Kali comes in. So when you have a malefic plan, like Mandy Gulika in Scorpio, Saturn in Scorpio, you listen to Kali Sahasranama and see what changes it brings into you. What happens in the next three or four days? What kind of decisions you are, decisions you are making? And the another one is uh, education related troubles, you know, you're not able to enjoy your metabolism is extremely going slow down, you're not able to enjoy the life, you know, all those Mercurian traits, problem with siblings, and Rakshabandhan has just gone, communication, business related, your business is not flourishing, your business name is getting bad, then you listen to Rag Gandharva, Rag Kalyana, Rag Purvi. And this is also for the, you know, within the happiness, happiness within the family, like a lot of pe people do not play within the houses. This is the one major issue. If you want your kids to play, if you want your kids to leave cell phones, start doing activities with them, like start painting together, start playing Ludo together, do some activities together, because if you are on phone, your kids will be on phone. You have to limit your phone time because problem with the mercury is that you have adding mercury to Rahu, you're watching things which are not useful, which is fine. That's what mercury does. As a kid, you do all those nonsense activities, like you start digging into earth, right? Nonsense activity, but this is how mercury is. Mercury requires a zero time period. Listen to it very carefully. It will save you from a lot of diseases. It will save you a lot of money going to hospital. And if you want you to not get thyroid issue, diabetics, and any other issue which is related to nerves, like the other day, you know, the hospital thing is going on and we're getting ready now. I was talking to the, the one of the doctors, she's specialized in only the chronic diseases. She does only paralysis, cancers, 
and any disease which has gone to the stem level or nerves level so she was telling me different ways you can enhance the medic medication and you know decrease the effect of the cancer she is specialized in cancer so i think within a month we will be ready I, within three or four days we will start opening up the website then we'll start taking the bookings slowly we'll see how it goes so if we do mistakes please bear with us reason being is it's first time i'm doing something which is i have not i have zero experience in but what i'm what i've thought is you know my intention is extremely clear with this that this is what i want to do <clears throat> so when you have a chronic problems now it's only the mercury which can it's only mercury you have not paid attention to because all those useless things all that fiber in your food mercury catalyst in your food is missing first of all secondly you know when the kings were about to become the king now they they used to overwork on something they used to go on a one we are like you go into nature do nothing just observe it you require breaks in between so you need to find activities like painting coloring drawing yantras going into a mode of kid so that you can understand your brain can go and relax and say okay he is actually relaxing let me go shut down and start healing let me rejuvenate this is how the mercury works so you need to be very careful with the mercury and part otherwise the problems of uh, the disease will will creep and that's why pcud and pcu says i mean you're trying the, to solve the pcud and PCUS, pcos using the external medicines the problem is inside all the only, only thing you need to do is you need to realize how can i balance what the imbalances so you have to start with a lifestyle change the moment you do the lifestyle change it has to be the extremely big shift and i will come to the one of the most biggest remedies of food you know in separate video but giving out zero time period for your brain is extremely important find out time where your kids can do things which has no meaning like you know playing ludo badminton anything which can take their mind off all the other things and accept the cell phone as well and you know kids are going to follow you if you are watching cell phone if you are on cell phone 24/7 the kids are going to follow it then we have a raga net bhairav this is a you know regeneration regeneration kind of ragas because this is belongs to chakra medicine ragas relationship issues money related troubles uh, married life issues your body is not you know regenerating you're getting old very quickly all the chakra related problems net bhairav brinda bani sarang just these are the two ragas you need to focus on start listening to it once you start listening to these ragas you will start paying attention to how you can add beauty within the relationship how you can be more graceful in life how you can spend your money more effectively what is the real use of money the real use of money is so that you can sleep in peace when you start waking up due to money this is when the venus has started getting afflicted in your chart the last one which is extremely important the base string of the of the music which is a saturn professional related issues long term diseases chronic problems uh, anything which you think you know saturn is like you know ki i will not let you live but i will not kill you this is what the saturn does to a person so when you have these kind of problems go for raga janpuri raga kiravani nilambari these are the raga of the saturn signs so when you listen when you will listen to this particular ragas and the prayers in these ragas what happens the energy around you changes the yantras are made within your brain and all these yantras attract people opportunities and things in a way that you you will feel okay this is this is what i wanted in my life but rahu and ketu these two are left so i've realized ketu is spiritual things you know when when you sing with that it's a you know cover voice all those cover songs if you have a ketu very prominent you will like nusrat fateh ali khan you will like songs which are sung like uh, qawwali and shir o shayari which are sung without the any kind of music instruments and in devotion complete devotions 
so that is a ketu kind of a music rahu kind of music is when you listen to a music like uh, trance when there's a lot of uh, eco effect within the music that's a rahu kind of music and uh, there's a particular uh, group a shanti group if you go and search on youtube and they have some mahisha soramardini when i listened to the first time i was like okay this is a pure rahu energy mercury rahu energy which is coming out mahisha soramardini so you should check that video out as well but <clears throat> once you start listening to music the effects around you are going to change the words of which you are going to use even on every day basis and this is what you have to do on every day basis as well you know it's not only the music it's about watch carefully what words you are using and within that word is actually the most problematic thing in your life if you are using words which are abusive if you are using words which are hurtful to others those words are going to get stored within your chart within your brain and you're going to attract that kind of energy because the problem with the with think subconscious is and problem with hating with someone as well when you hate someone you try to abuse them and when you abuse them you actually try to hurt yourself only because that person is going to get out you are actually taking the path of asbhagya this is what you are doing when you are abusing people so it's and you know that's why you know, the paraninda is one of the biggest sins said told in hinduism so to get rid of it i will suggest you focus on what you are doing what your words are if you can watch your words if you can get the straight get these music morning evening and night if you can listen to three times you know i mean this is how you should start your day when you're waking up make sure that there's a very positive vibe in the house like there's a there's a light entering your house music is going on the good energies come in when you're about to sleep play ragas i mean what you do it four days five days sixth day your kids will come in and say we need to listen to this particular rag we need to listen to rag yaman or they will know which thumbnail to press and once it happens now then you know the kids are actually going to get connected to the realms and they are going to heal themselves they are going to be more pacified listen to you because it is not them they are they are not doing it consciously they are doing it subconsciously they are actually under the the rhythm of watching the phone and not obeying you people get diseased due to this these particular reasons so i hope this video video will help out a lot of kids and a lot of parents out there and people who are suffering from various kind of problems in their life you listen to it and then we'll see how so once you once you listen to it let me know how it has helped you out and you can ask uh, any particular combination in the comment section and i'll see you guys next time thank you bye bye